friends, my name is Holly and welcome back to our channel. This is my little Maddie girl and we're going to show you our baby boy's haul from our recent baby shower and she's excited to share with y'all her baby brother stuff. She has been in his room. We're actually in his room today and kind of giving y'all a little bit of a sneak peek. We're going to share more of his room. We're going to share like a haul video of some things that we got for his room, us putting it together and a room tour towards maybe starting in July because there's a few more things that we want to finish up with. But we are sitting in his room so you are getting a little sneak peek and we have stuff surrounding us from the shower and we were so blessed and we are so grateful for all the things that we received. And we're gonna be sharing a few favorites with y'all, some things that I think that y'all might like and a few tips and tricks. So we'll go ahead and get started. There's a lot of things to share. There are some really cute, like, sentimental things that I'm going to share towards the end of the video. So stick around for that if you're interested for some cute little ideas uh, for sentimental gifts. And we'll go ahead and get started. So this week actually starts third trimester for me and, or for us, and uh, we have been feeling so good, but we get out of breath so easy. So as I'm doing this video, I'm going to be trying not to breathe heavy, but I'm going to be moving around a lot and getting things. So I know that the breathing heavy drives y'all crazy because it drives me crazy. I'm like, would you stop? But here we are. So we're going to try to push through together. So the first thing that I want to share with y'all today is the brand Willow. So this is someone that I partnered with for today's video. And I'm so excited to share with y'all this. So this is a cordless breast pump. And I asked a lot of people over on Instagram, uh, be sure to follow me on Instagram to see like more tips and tricks and what I'm learning and helping me learn. Um, Cause a lot of y'all give me lots of tips and tricks over there and I like to share them over there as well. But I did like a little question on Instagram on my stories and asked what everybody's favorite cordless breast pump was. And there was a lot of favorites, but in the top was Willow. And so I'm so excited to be able to be working with them today and sharing with y'all the things that I know about them. I'm not going to be going into much detail about them because I personally haven't got to use it yet and experience. And I like to give an honest review. So I had already opened the box. So I was going to show y'all what it looked like. So you can use your phone. And then I also, let's turn it right here so we can see. So it says goes where you go. So again, it's cordless. It's quiet. It says pump, pour, or pump and store. Um, easy to use and clean and no more spilled milk. And so I've seen lots of reviews because um, I started looking them on. I found them on Instagram, followed them and watched people's reviews and looked up things on like TikTok and YouTube. And it's just very helpful information. And so I've seen a lot with this. So uh, I guess we'll open it up and kind of look at it together. So if you are new here, I'm a first time mom, so this is all new to me. So be sure to hit that subscribe button if you want to join us and the becoming of a mother and all the joys of motherhood and the lessons to be learned and tips and tricks. So I'm gonna be sharing all that here with y'all on my channel. We do a lot of decorating on my channel, but we're a lifestyle channel too. And so since we're having baby boy coming into our world, I'm gonna be sharing y'all our life and how we're doing things over this way that works for us. So here are the little breast pumps and then just stick them down in your bra, which they also have bras too. And we're going to get those later because I don't know what size that I need right now, but it does come with a breast bra that you can get. So here's the little breast pumps and then there is 24 four ounce bags in here and then it has the little seals and then it comes with instructions, which we're definitely going to have to read. Let's see what all it has in here. And then it has some more little gadgets like little brushes to clean. So I'm really excited about this and it's so thankful for Willow for working with us on today's video. I cannot wait to use this. A lot of people said that they love it and it's so easy and so convenient. And with me having my YouTube channel and baby boy is supposed to be here in September. So like kicking off to fall, I am still planning if everything works out great. I still want to shoot videos for y'all and do decorate with me to make our house cozy as we're doing like new traditions and stuff with our baby boy. And so I knew that I was going to want to do a breast pump, make it a little bit easier for me as we are still hopefully doing things around the house. So that is the plan, but I know everything changes and everything's different. So we're just taking things day by day. 
So again, if you want to see more about this, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And then also follow me over on Instagram because whenever he gets here, I'll be doing a full review on this. So if you're interested in this one and been wondering which one to get, like I said, I had a lot of people that recommended this one. I will put my link down in the description box down below and you can check them out. Also, if you have the Willow Pump, I would love in the comments down below if you would let me know what works for you, what you love about it, some like pros and cons. I love doing these videos where all the new moms, we can all just look in the comments and just have like a community here of motherhood. Even though it is very exciting, it is also very overwhelming with all the things that you have to learn and the gadgets and the tips and tricks. I think this is a great place for us to all just come together and help each other out. So we have lots of things that I'm about to share and I wanted to let y'all know kind of how I um, did my baby registry because doing that was, even though like some things were really fun to do, some things were really stressful and overwhelming to me because there is so many different things out there. And so you're like, which one do I register for? Which one do I need to buy? I don't want to waste my money. What do I need? And so what I did is I actually got on Pinterest. I found this so easy. I got on Pinterest and just pinned some of my favorite little checklists that tells you like everything that you need to register for. So um, it breaks it down for you. I'll put the little graphic right here so you can see. So definitely get on Pinterest and find one of those, screenshot it or pin it and use that to help build your registry. And then also some of the things like the diaper genie, the baby monitor, the baby wipes. What I did is I just got on Amazon and typed in baby wipe warmer and I registered for the one that had the most reviews and the highest stars. And so that seemed to work best for me. It was a lot less overwhelming and Amazon just makes it really easy that way. And so I did register on Amazon. And what I'll do for you if you're a new time mom or if you have somebody in your family that is gonna be having a baby, I'm gonna link my registry down below so you can shop my registry. So if there's anything in this video that you see that you like and would like to register for yourself or a gift to someone, then it's just right there and really easy for y'all to see. And hopefully that will help y'all out a lot. I've watched a lot of YouTubers and did the same thing and um, shopped their registry and registered for things that they did. And it made it so easy and convenient for me. So I wanna be a help to you guys as well. Okay, the first thing that I was gonna share with y'all, and we're gonna go through these super fast because I have a lot I wanna share with y'all. So the first thing I registered for, we did go ahead and open everything up so we could test it out and see if we like it. But this is the baby monitor. And y'all can let me know in the comments down below if you have these items and if you love them, hate them, like the pros, cons, please let us know in the comments down below. Or if you have something that is more of a favorite. So this is the one that I registered for and it looks like it's just called, it says, Hello Baby. So again, I'm gonna link my registry so you can go find all these items and you can shop by the pictures. It'll be really easy and convenient. So this is the one that we got. It did come with two cameras. It has all these little features on it. Volume, lullaby, temperature, timer, move your camera up and down so you can get different views of the room. It has a mic where you can talk through it um, or hear if the baby's crying or not. And so we're gonna try this one out. Again, let me know if you have this one and what your thoughts are on it. Okay, I think I'm gonna go through gadgets first. So the next thing, was this bottle warmer. And I've already, like I said, opened everything up to kind of test it. And this one had really good reviews on Amazon. I was worried that the bottles that I registered for that my cousin told me about that she loved was not gonna fit in this. So I tested it out and it does. So this is linked in my Amazon shop. And then also here are the bottles that I registered for. So they are a silicone bottle and pacifier set. So it comes with two five ounce bottles and two nine ounce bottles, and then two breast like pacifiers. I didn't even know that it came with that. So she was highly recommending this. It had really good reviews on Amazon. And these are the ones that I got. So let me know what you think about these. But I'll also put them down in this little bottle warmer and they fit great. So we're gonna try those out. This I did not register for, but I will go and add it to my registry and figure out how to mark it as purchased or whatever. But we were gifted this and one of Miss Althea's coworkers gifted it to us. And she said that her, she just had a grandbaby and said that her kids love this, that it was wonderful. So I'm excited to try it out. This is a five inch car baby monitor. So let me know if you have one of these or not. Um, it says capture video and photo, voice activated. It has night vision. So 
This seemed really fancy and really cool. I had registered for just a regular mirror and we did get that too, but we're gonna get that put in Drew's vehicle. Um, so he'll have the setup. So if he's gonna have baby boy for the afternoon or something, then he can have his vehicle set up and then we'll put this stuff in mind because if we all go out as a family and of course all having more than Drew does, then um, my car will have, I guess, probably the more cooler gadgets because that's the vehicle that he's going to be in all the time. So I thought this was really cool. So let me know what your thoughts are on this. If you have a nice little smaller like gadget thing that I registered for that I've heard a lot of people talk about is the baby shisher. If you are not familiar with this, my cousin Kayla got this at her baby shower and we all thought it was so cool. How do you turn this on? And so I knew I wanted to register for one, but then turn the volume up or down and it literally just goes. Shh. So I think there's like different settings you can use. Like it'll shh, shh, shh. It's just crazy to me. So I'm excited to try this thing out. This, thing, this had lots of reviews on Amazon and this is a thermometer. And so all you do is hold it like just a few inches away from your forehead and it checks your temperature. Um, we have tried this out on a lot of people and I just love it. So not only is this great for baby boy, but we're going to put this in our little medicine cabinet as well. So if Drew and I get sick, we can check our temperature. It is so fast. I love this thing. It, um, had lots of reviews, like thousands of reviews and everybody loved this. So I definitely recommend getting this if you have a, if you're going to be having a baby or if you just need a new thermometer. The next thing is all of the baby Frida or Frida stuff. Everybody just loves these things. So we have, I did not know what this was and they told me and it's hilarious. So this is the Wendy the Gas Passer. So insert this and it helps to relieve the gas pains. And so people were telling me at the shower that these things were amazing. So I got some of those. I didn't register for those. Those were just gifted to me from a new mom. And then also didn't register for these either. But my cousin Kayla was telling me that I needed some. And so I was gifted them um, from a new mom as well. And this is little bitty nail files. And then also we got a thing of nail clippers and the little file again. And then I did register for the, if they're congested. So I've heard that all this um, free to baby stuff is amazing. Okay, y'all saw in one of my last videos, like um, whenever I shared the closet, um, I shared like little hauls and things that we had already received in the mail. And I received one bathtub that everybody loved, but then also a lot of people were talking about this one that they loved. So I registered for both to see which one that we were gonna like better. But this one um, is inflatable. And I believe that you can wash it as well. And so a lot of people were really loving this one. And so I decided to get it to try it out. And then also for the bathtub, this was so cute. So I found this on Amazon and put it on my registry. And it's a little rubber duck. And you stick it in the bathtub or in the water, just let it float and it tells the temperature of the water. So, you know, if you have it too hot or too cold for baby. Okay, I hope I'm not going too fast for y'all, but like I said, I have a lot to share. So we're just going right through them and you can go check out, check them out on the registry and read the reviews, see if this is something that you like, that you think that you might like. I um can't really give y'all my reviews on this stuff because he's not here yet for us to test it out. This is just the stuff that I had seen on other people's channels. People loved and thought that I would try out. So, burp cloths. I've heard that everybody loves like these little muslim burp cloths and clothes and bibs and everything. So, I got these. They come in all different kinds of colors. But I got the tan and the cream. And then I also got these. I just love this little checkered pattern right now so cute so i got that one in this color i believe it was a two pack also registered for and got again all this stuff comes in different colors so it's like baby boy baby girl um neutral or colorful so i registered for these this is swaddles or blankets and i just loved the colors of these and they're so soft so this came in a pack of four and also all these bibs came in a pack they are so pretty. I love the colors. There's black, it's like a blue, green, gray, cream, navy, a 
muted blue, another green, a light gray, and a white. So lots of these, and I cannot wait to use these. My cousin told me she has seven kids, and her last two were twins. So she had five kids, and then they got pregnant again, and they have twins. She's like rock star mom. So I asked her a lot of things. But she loved putting these around her little twins' necks. And then if they were stuffy or something, she would put Young Living Essential Oils on here, like the Sniffle Ease. She would drop some oils on here and tie it around their neck so it was around their chest and helped them breathe. She said it worked very well, and I know a lot of other moms use that too. So we got a lot of these. So he's going to be so cute in these. I cannot wait for him to wear these little bandanas. We also didn't register for these, so I'm not sure where they came from. I'm sure you can find them off of Amazon. But these are the cutest little bibs. So I had registered for some that were just plain. They didn't have the little checkered, but my friend found these somewhere and she knows I love this little checkered print. And so she got these. These are gonna be really nice whenever he goes eat baby food or something. So it can drip down in here and it's easy to wipe clean. They're just rubber. So like I said, these are on my Amazon registry, but they don't have the checkered on them. But I'm sure you could probably find them on Amazon. Next thing is Oh, I don't even know what you would call this, but it came with a little pouch. You put it over you. It actually had a lot of different uses. Um, I can only remember two right now though, but whenever you're out and about and you need to breastfeed, you can slip this over your head like so and have some privacy. And it has like little pockets and I loved it because it was black and white stripe. But then also, um, was used to put over like car seats and things like that, like a little car seat cover. And so I thought this was really nice and it's really good material too. It's almost like um, that dry fit material. So it's like very breathable. I also registered for one of these. So this is a boba wrap and I've already opened it up and I tested it out. I put Maddie in it. She actually loved it. She stayed in it for a while as I was cleaning and organizing his room. So I'm not going to show y'all how to put it on. Um, just cause we need to go through this video quick, but I think that I'm going to love this. The, idea of it whenever I first opened it up I was like oh my gosh it is so long I was like this is gonna be so complicated I'm a little worried but the instructions are so easy to read I threw it on in like just a few seconds and then um I'll probably have to read the instructions again a couple of times till I get the hang of it or like remember how to do it but like I said it was super easy actually I think that I could do it again without even using the instructions so don't let these intimidate you I had a I heard a lot of really good things about this brand so let me know if you have this one and what your thoughts were on it but I think that I'm really gonna like it and I got the color in gray the next thing, this is not on my registry, so if you're interested in any of this, be sure to email me at simplylakeinlace at yahoo.com. So I am so excited to use these products on our baby boy. The Oli moms that I know love this stuff and it's all natural. We're gonna do things as natural as possible with our baby, like no fragrance. We're not gonna be using like fragrance soaps or anything like that. I want it to be all natural so it's good for his skin and those things. So we have Tender Tush. This is all by Young Living. So I order this stuff monthly. If you're new to my channel, I am a huge Young Living fan, have been for years now. And I actually have a link where you can buy through me and I can help you out with ordering or give you information on it or brochure. So if you're interested again, email me about it. Um, I started doing that because I love this stuff and I talk about it and share it anyway. And it's like, one of my favorite things to talk about is like switching over from like the harsh chemical stuff to the more natural stuff. So we have Tender Tush and actually I've been using this and the Young Living V6 oil. I mix them and put it on my hand, mix it together, rub it all over my belly, everywhere. And it, this stuff I heard from lots of moms that it helped with like stretch mark preventative. So I've been using that and so far no stretch marks. And I actually went to the doctor my last visit and whenever she was listening to his heartbeat, she was like, your skin looks amazing. What are you using? I turned to the Young Living and she was like, oh yeah. So she was familiar with it and she actually loves the stuff too. She knows that I use it. And anytime that we're talking back and forth about things I'm using and doing, I tell her the Young Living, she's like, okay, good, good. So 
my doctor loves it as well. So this is the Seedlings Calm. So this is all, I'm gonna try to do this very quickly, but this is all, all natural oils. Like a lot of oils that you get from like stores or online have additives in them. So this is the difference in Young Lemon Oils and other oil is basically this in a nutshell. I'm gonna speak it easy for y'all, is if you are super sick and you go to the refrigerator, are you going to grab Sunny D orange juice or 100% cold pressed organic all natural orange juice to make yourself feel better? I think you would go for the organic all natural one because it's all natural, there's no additives in it. Like the Sunny D has maybe like 5% of real orange juice and the rest is full of artificial flavorings and things like that to make it taste like orange juice, but it's not really orange juice. So this is why I use Young Living Oils because they are like 100%, no additives, no like man-made chemical fragrances. Like this is all stuff that comes from God's beautiful creation, the earth, his plants, and like Young Living, even the seeds that they put in the ground, they won't even plant a seed into the ground until the soil's been fully tested and there cannot be like any chemicals like sprays or anything like that on it for years, it's gotta be like perfect before they even plant that seed. And then also they do not like spray their weeds. It's all like hand picked. So they are very particular about what they do. So this is why I use their oils. Yes, they are a little bit more pricey, but you are going to get what you pay for again with the Sunny D orange juice or the organic orange juice. So for us and baby, we want the best of the best. So this is the seedlings calm. So I have him a little diffuser that we're gonna put beside his bed whenever he actually uses his bed. And well, actually I'll put this in the diffuser in our room in his little bassinet. That's so cute. I cannot wait to share that with y'all. But this was one that we'll put in his diffuser at nighttime. This is the Sleepy Eyes. And so we'll be using that one too in his diffuser. And then also the Sniffle Ease. So my friend got me this stuff and we can never have too many oils around here. So I had already had some bottles of these, but when I opened this up, I was so excited. So this is the one that I was telling y'all that we'll put on his little bibs to help open him up if he gets congested. And then we also have these seedlings baby wipes. So these are lavender baby wipes. Again, there's no like fragrance, like the chemical lab made fragrance in it. This is like true lavender from a field and we love these. I use these actually to get the first cut of my first light layer of my makeup off. So starting him out on his little health journey. So there's my little health tip for you for the day. Yeah. So many pacifiers, really cute ones. I'm not going to share those with y'all because I don't know which one he's going to like. I know everybody, every baby is different between bottles and pacifiers. So I'll share with y'all which ones that he likes and that we're using once he gets here. But I did get these little Patsy clips and I didn't register for them, but I wanted to share with y'all. They're so cute. This one's by Mud Pie. And then I don't know which one or what brand this is, but you can find these on Amazon, little Patsy fire clips. So we got those. And then I did register for this and it is so cute. I'm about to show you all the toys that we registered for. But this is a, ooh, whoop. A wubba nub, is that right? Anyway, it's a little pacifier, which I've heard so many friends tell me that their babies loved this. So it's a little passy attached to a little animal. There's so many different animals you can choose from, and I loved the little deer one. So Drew and I actually we did most of our registry together, and so we were agreeing on like all the same things. We have like the same taste and what we want for baby boy, thankfully, so it's been fun. And so we both loved the deer and I think it's so sweet. So we got that. Registered for a few little toys and then got some um, that we're not registered for and they are so cute. So I'm gonna share with you some of our favorites. I registered for this little barn little toy. It is so soft and so cute. So it has little farm animals in here. So it has a little chicken and I'm gonna cut the tags off of these. And then it has a little bitty cow, like y'all, how cute is this? And they're so soft. And then also, I don't want to pull them out, but it has a little sheep. And then it also has a horse. And it has little holes where you can stick their head. And it has like a little handle, like a little carrying case. And again, this is so soft and I love the colors of it. 
So I have like a little shelf coming and I'm planning on actually displaying this on his little shelf because it's just so cute. So if you're interested in this one, I think they have one too that's actually more colorful. If you like the more colorful things, I think that they have like a red barn maybe. So be sure to check this one out. So this is something that Drew's sweet nanny got us and my nursery was actually done in lambs and we actually got a few things that were lambs. Like we got, we I'll show you in a minute, but we got some books that had it um stories about lambs and then also nanny gifted us this and she didn't know that my nursery was done in lamb so this is such a special little gift so it's just like a little lamb i already had got him a bear one um but it's called a lovey blanket and i heard that babies and toddlers love these so i think it is so sweet look at his little feet so i'm sure you can find these on amazon just type in lovey blanket next thing that i thought was so cute were these little trucks or these little cars whenever drew came home after the shower was over to look at everything just going through things and he loved these little cars look how cute they are they're just little wooden toys and so um they do roll and drew already checked them out to make sure the wheels weren't going to come off and they look like they are good to go so i'm actually probably going to put these on his shelves or something like that too, just because they're so cute. And then also this little rattle. So he does have one that I already got him that's a bear. And this one was on Amazon and it is so sweet. This little deer, and it has a little wooden handle. And then also this little teether. I liked the colors in it and thought it was cute. Also for a toy and that little medicine cabinet thing. It's this little fox, so I didn't register for this, but I have heard of these, and my cousin gifted this to me and was telling me how much her little girl loved them, and she had a bunch of them. So this is called a Warmy, and it actually has inside of it, I don't know what all's inside of it. I think it does have like lavender buds in it though, and something else, but you put it in the microwave and heat it up, and she said it's really good for babies that have colic. Um, and then also tummy issues as they get older. So you warm it up and then they snuggle with it. And she said that her little girl says that it helps her so much. And when, even whenever she was a baby, it helped her whenever she had the colic. So she got him the fox. I thought it was so sweet. And then also she gifted us these books. And it was like a cute little gift together because it was the fox and then the books. And these books are beautiful. So what we did was, I'm sure that a lot of y'all have already heard about this or seen this idea before, but instead of getting cards for the baby shower, we asked if people would, even if it was like an old book that they had like put up in the attic from their kids, or it could be like new or used, but we asked for books and that they signed the books. So whenever we read the books to our baby boy at nighttime, then we could see and remember who gifted it to him. And a lot of people gifted us books that their children loved and was saying in the book, I hope that y'all enjoy this book as much as me and my baby did. And so I thought that was so sweet. So I'm gonna share with y'all these just because these are so pretty and cute that I'm probably gonna put them displayed on one of these shelves. Um, and I liked the idea that she did. So the stories are basically the fox is the main character. And so she gifted us the books and the fox so i thought that was sweet but it says our little adventures and then it has a trip to the farmer's market a trip to the forest and a trip to the wildflower meadow so she said she got these off of amazon and i already read this one out loud to drew just so we could see how cute it was but they like rhyme and the illustrations are just so pretty i love them oops and then in the back Instead of writing, she put little Bible verses and sweet little messages in them. So I thought that was really sweet. And then also at the end of the book, it has little pictures and what they are up under them. And it says farmer's market vocabulary. And so you could do the little point, like what is this, what is this? And then also these pictures are in the book. So you could go through and be like, let's, flip through and find the apple. So I just thought that these were the sweetest and again, so pretty. So I wanted to share those with y'all. Moving right along, we're gonna do some clothes next and then we're gonna do some like swings and bouncers, car seat, and then sentimental things. So 
these really stood out to me when I unwrapped these. I think that y'all saw these in my baby shower video. These are just so cute. I love the little dogs and they ran. The next little accessory that I wanted to share was this little Carhartt hat. So sweet. So my husband Drew loves Carhartt. Cannot wait to see him in this. He is going to be so stinking handsome and cute. Little cowboy boots. He can wear his little hat backwards. And so my mother-in-law knows how much Drew loves Carhartt things. And so she hooked us up with the Carhartt. Sister again knows how much he loves this brand and this little camouflage and actually I'm going to get him something that matches this for Father's Day that says Rad Dad on it by the brand Burly Bow. It is so soft. It's the cutest little onesie and we're going to get Drew a matching outfit for this one. Not like totally matching because Drew's not going to wear a onesie. It's going to be a shorts and t-shirt that matches this camouflage in the same brand. There are a few clothes. So a lot of this came from Amazon off of my registry and if you don't see it on there, you can find it on Amazon, I'm sure. But again, my mother-in-law gifted him these little Carhartt overalls. How cute are these? I cannot wait to see him in this stuff. And then we have this little outfit that I thought was super cute. It says, Mama is my best girl. And it comes with these little pants. All this is so soft. And then this little outfit, which my husband Drew is an Auburn fan. And their colors are like navy and orange. So I thought that this could be something cute that he could wear. It'd be pretty for fall colors and football season. And then also this little outfit says a little love on it. Can't wait to see his little legs coming out of this. I loved this. So there's this one. And then there's still one on my registry that says babe on it. And it's black and white. But I thought these, I just love these little outfits. And then these have, this one has the hood on it too. I just think they're going to be really cute and comfy on him. Also, he was gifted this little underarm outfit. It is so soft and it's blue, white, and black. This little outfit was so cute. It's like that muslin material. This little outfit was so sweet. It comes with a pair of pants and I loved the little buttons. And then look how cute this little chicken outfit is. So this one is big enough that he'll be able to wear it spring of next year. I think he's gonna be so cute running around the farm. Well, I guess he won't be running around the farm, but I think it'll be really cute wearing this at the farm next spring. Your little holiday outfits. Some are on my Amazon registry and some are not. I was trying to share more of what was on my Amazon registry, so if you wanted to shop them, you could easily, but then some things I just wanted to add to it. So this one should still be on there little jack-o'-lanterns. I love these, like the little trick-or-treat pails. This one, hand-picked pumpkin patch, farm fresh. So I'm hoping that he can wear this one and we get to go to the pumpkin patch this year. I know he won't be able to play, but we go every year anyway with my niece and nephew. We can get a few cute pictures of him there. This was so cute. So my friend got him this outfit. And so I said, he's gonna have to wear this to our friends giving event this year. So it's a little, this is by the brand Mud Pie. I love Mud Pie brand. And it came with this little hat. How stinking cute is this? I love that. Also, a friend got this too. And it's a really cute little Christmas outfit. It's got the little gingham pants, the tree, the hat, and it also comes with a little pair of socks. So this is all the little holiday stuff that he got. So I wanted to share all that. The next thing that we got, everybody has raved about these. And so I registered for one and it's the Snuggle Me Organics. They did have like a 40% off sale. I don't know if they're still on sale or not, but that was a really good discount. I think it was for Memorial Day um, and they were still running it. So I'm sure if they go off sale, if you wait till like another holiday, they'll probably have another sale on them. But this is just a little lounger that apparently all babies love and buy covers for these also. So we probably will buy a cover for it just so we can wash it. Now for the bigger items. So this is the car seat that I asked on Instagram. Everybody was talking about that they love. So this is the Nuna. And I registered for this one because we were gifted this mom push stroller. 
which I've shared on my channel already, and it is so nice. And so it comes with different attachments with it. I'll show you up in its closet. So it has like a bassinet, and then it also has a like seat that can be front or rear facing. So it came with those two attachments already. I love the colors. It comes in several different colors. It comes with the cup holder. Again, I shared this on another video, so you can go check that one out. To be able to attach it to the car seat or the car seat attaches this stroller it comes with these little gadgets and this is the one that i chose to fit on it and it matches it is the black and the brown and then it has the little visor and then this is actually what it looks like so pretty and like i said a lot of people were raving about this one online and it was like one of the top car seats and so we got this one, but we were also told that their heads are so small whenever they leave the hospital that they needed an extra cushion. So we registered for this to put in here and we'll just hold his head up just a little bit better. If I can figure out how to, I think it goes like this. Anyway, so we got that to put in there. And then also for the stroller attachment there already is one cup holder which does hold my stanley but i registered for this as well so this is the mom cozy and i love this so i can put his bottles in here it has a little storage right there it also has storage here and then it comes with a little strap so you can carry it as a little purse if you needed to so you can put diapers and bibs in there my phone can go here and then this is like where you can put debit cards chapstick lip gloss anything like that and it also detaches so you can unzip it it has a little wristlet so if you were at the park or out and about you don't have to take a purse or anything and just put everything in here and if you need to walk away from the stroller like even at disney or an amusement park if you needed to take the baby and walk away from the stroller you can just take your money and things out of this so i thought this was really nice and again it matched the aesthetic of this stroller and car seat and so i did get that and now this is our little get up and go set up and i cannot wait to see baby boy in this take him for a ride two more items that i registered for so this like has a full set so there's even like a pack and play high chair that all come and match this and I love this. So this is by the brand at Maxi Cossi. So I registered for these two, the swing and like the little seat bouncer. And so the swing, just love the colors of this. This has got like wood grain. Drew and I loved this whole set whenever we saw it. So we were very thankful that we got some of these items off of our registry. And then we'll cut the tags off of these, but it has like the little toys. And then also you plug it in, it has different settings. So it swings the baby. Back and forth. It has music. You can set a timer. Drew was playing with it. And he said he thought it was pretty cool. And then this is the little like seat bouncer thing. So this one, I think most seats will like vibrate or sing or something. This one does not have any like electronic features, but it does have this where you can adjust it to lay it more flat. So a newborn can lay in it. Um, and then you can, as he grows, adjust it. And then it does have a button somewhere where it completely collapses, where it's easy to carry and store. So we're going to collapse this completely and put it in his closet until he gets here and can use it. And this material is so soft and it unzips. So you can actually throw this in the wash if your baby gets it a little dirty. So this is his little play gym that we registered for. It has a little mirror and then it collapses real easy. It has all these little toys on it. I think they're so sweet. It has a little book, these little toys. And what I was telling y'all that I could do with this is this little, I wanna get like a little play mat as well, but I could also use this little snuggle me up under there and he could lay under there and have something to look at and play with as he gets a little bit older. Okay, I promise y'all we're about done, but I wanted to share with y'all some like sentimental things that we were gifted for him and it's so sweet. So first off, my grandma, 
she painted this. There's a local place to us um, that actually you can go and paint ceramics and then they like put them in the oven or whatever they do to fire it up to cure it. And she painted that for him. So I think this is so cute. I cannot wait to display this in his room. And my grandma's mom and dad, they actually, if I'm saying this right, which I'm pretty sure that I was told this, um, I know that my, my great grandma used to hand paint ceramics all the time and sell them, but I actually think that they had a business doing that. And so that is really special to me. Another thing that's really special is this blanket that my aunt made. So she like fixed all my prom dresses, like altered them, altered my wedding dress. She is just like the sewing queen. And so she gifted me one of these blankets and it is so soft. And what's special about this is my family collected shirts from all the dads in the family. So like Drew's, Drew's dad, um, and the grandfather's my dad and she cut the little shirts in squares and then made a quilt out of it so they told me whose shirt belonged to who and i love that it has drew's work shirt on it i love this so my husband is a lineman so we did get a few lineman things and i just thought it was so sweet and they put his little one of his little work shirts on here and I just think it's so sweet and it's so soft too to be made out of so many different materials so this was really precious to me and a wonderful keepsake my mother-in-law kept a lot of Drew's baby things so she had it all wrapped up pretty in a box and we won't go through all of it but there's like little outfits in here little ties little shoes some of his little socks, also these. Let me know if you had these. I had these whenever I was growing up and we use these all the time. And so the little Barney plates and bowls. And my mom said that she actually still has the forks and spoons that go to this. So I may have to get those from her just to use to go with this. Lots of little outfits. How stinking cute. I cannot wait to put these on him and get the pictures from Miss Althea's house and compare Drew and baby boy. He also gifted us some of Drew's books that he had whenever he was a baby. And then this is a huge surprise because Drew has talked about this ever since I've known him about the toy that he used to play with whenever he was young and that is these little Hot Wheels. And so she found some of his Hot Wheels and I cannot wait for our baby boy to play with these because Drew talks about how he would go outside and make little tracks and play with his Hot Wheels all the time. And he had like a case for them all. And so he is wanting to like get our boy set up with some Hot Wheels and hopefully our little boy will like them as much as Drew did, we'll see. And everybody has different personalities, but Drew's excited to see if our son is gonna like Hot Wheels as much as he did. So I thought these were really sweet. So. Next sentimental item that we received is this adorable little rocking chair with the wear and tear. It's green, so it matches his curtains. And this was actually Drew's dad's. So this is over 50 years old. And his dad said that he was gonna paint it and he said, I just don't know if I want to or not. And I'm glad that he didn't because it shows like the wear and tear on it from whenever he used it as he was a baby or a toddler. And I just think this is so cute. And how perfect was it that it was green and already matched like the decor that we were using kind of in his room. And my mom pointed this out. She was like, look where his little butt scooched on and off the chair all those years. His little feet were up here. So I thought this was so sweet and I cannot wait to use this in his room and to see baby boy sitting in it. And I know Mr. Tim is gonna love seeing our baby boy use this chair. So here's all his little books that he has so far. And uh, we have a shelf coming in that I'm gonna put all his little books on and I cannot wait to read these to him. I've kind of looked through some of them and they're so sweet. I do wanna show y'all this one, it's very special. So this one says, my lineman, my daddy, my hero. And it's the sweetest little book. And I cannot wait to read this to little baby boy. It is so cute. This one did come from Amazon, like I said. And I already read through it with Drew. And it's just so sweet. So 
I wanted to share with y'all that one. But all these books have the signatures of all the people that gifted it to them. Okay, I am wore out from sharing all of that with y'all. I hope that y'all enjoyed seeing that video. I hope that it gave y'all some ideas on maybe what to put on your registry. We did get like towels and a few more other things too. I loved watching these videos before my baby shower to see kind of what we needed. I just love sharing this little baby stuff. It is so much fun. If you're new to my channel, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button for all things baby, all things home decor, like homemaking. I am going to be sharing with y'all a few recipes and like little drink recipes from out in the garden because our garden is coming in beautifully. We have a little cottage garden out back. So we love doing gardening on this channel too. And we're just going to be sharing all things home and now family. I hope that God blesses you. And if you're a new mommy and going through pregnancy with me, I hope that he blesses you and keeps you and your baby safe and well. And I love you guys so much. And I will see you guys on the very next one. Bye friends. Bye.